the quarry is completely absurd. That quarry is the lifeblood of this town. Our work there has been a source of pride for generations of miners. Why the hell is Dewey allowing this to go through? Why isn't he fighting it? Hmm? I just realized I've been ranting to a complete stranger. Wait, aren't you that swordsman who rescued my son? Sorry, I've just been thinking about the situation in the quarry a lot lately. And every time it makes my blood boil! Ever since they closed it, the Countsmen have been seen going in and out like they own the place. It's aggravating! That quarry is far too important to this town and everyone in it for us to just look the other way! At any rate, I hear you wiped out all the monsters down there. Even the big ones that nested in the deepest mines. Even if you're not from Redmond, you're a true friend to this town. Here, I've got something for you. I hope my son grows a spine like yours one of these days. Chester. At all. I'm sorry. I've just got a lot on my mind. My brother gave me this pendant. He left it here in a letter for me on the day he vanished. I guess it makes me feel closer to him when I wear it. But. In reality, he was closer than I ever realized all this time. I'm so sorry, Adol. So many horrible rumors have been going around about my brother. And then, to hear the man who raised me confirm them all? I just... want to know what's happening, and why. He must have a reason, right? Maybe I'm being selfish. I should just be grateful he's alive. In a way, it's like a weight I've been carrying for the last six months has been lifted from me. I may not know what's going through his mind just yet, but I do know that if I could talk to him, just talk to him, then things might go back to normal. So don't worry about me. I'll be okay. But thank you for your concern at all. I really do appreciate it. This has become quite serious indeed. Why would Father Pierre go to such a place? Please forgive me. I should have tried harder to stop him. My, my. Such blazing red hair. You must be Adol. I've heard murmurings about you amongst the townsfolk. My name is Nicholas. I am head of the Felgana Diocese. I was also the town's priest until three years ago. Now I serve at the castle, while Father Pierre enlightens the town. I still drop by from time to time, though. Old habits do die hard, as they say. <laughs> I fear, however, that my visit today may be a bit less transient than usual on account of Father Pierre's absence. Are you familiar with the Ilburn's ruins to the northeast of here? 
They are the remnants of a temple used by practitioners of a pagan religion from a long lost era. It would seem that Father Pierre has taken it upon himself to visit that temple for purposes unknown. It's unsafe in every regard. There's a dormant volcano behind it which has recently become active anew. And popular rumor suggests the place is infested with monsters of all shapes and sizes. All the more reason for concern. One cannot help but fear the worst. Adol. Adol Christian. They say you're the one who rescued Mayor Edgar from the quarry. Is this true? Given your considerable skill, might I humbly request you undertake another such mission to find Father Pierre? Such selfless courage. On behalf of the Church, you have my deepest gratitude. I believe you will be needing this. The Ilburn's ruins are just off the road, to the northeast of here. This key opens the access gate. Please, do whatever you can to ensure the safety of Father Pierre. May God be with you. Fight well, adventurer. Oh, 
Oh,